Alyssa, 125 months ago, I asked you to be my girlfriend. <laughs> From that day, you have completed my soul in an inexplicable way. Today, I stand before you to ask you to be my wife. You have filled my life with love and joy, and nothing I can do in this life could be better than doing the same for you every day. Adam, do you take Alyssa to be your lawfully wedded wife from this day forward? I do. Alyssa, do you take Adam to be your lawfully wedded husband from this day forward? I do. Alyssa and Adam started dating in middle school, uh, which I was like, well, this isn't going to last. <laughs> so after a while, they, uh, they went to a few dances together. He kept coming over. It was upsetting. So I moved to Florida, figured I'd get 1,500 miles away. And I was like, well, definitely not going to last. Alyssa's teaching in Boca. Adam's going to Vermont. And then COVID. Holy sh Adam is going to move to Florida. I said, oh, sh this might last. But honestly, um, it would have been selfish of me to continue to not treat Adam as a son. Adam, I love you. Alyssa, I love you more. <laughs> but I definitely love you together. Adam Lee. Throughout our relationship, there have been countless moments that I find myself thinking, there's no way I could ever love you more than I do right now in this moment. But every day, in every moment, my love for you has grown deeper and stronger. And now, sitting here writing this letter, I am yet again in awe because I have never felt so much love for you. You helped me through my worries and my fears and have shown me unconditional love through it all. You have always been there, holding on strong when I needed you the most. And to be clear, I will never not need you. I love you forever and always. Love, Alyssa. Well, you're about to walk out, and I cannot wait to see you in your dress for your first time. I've been waiting for this moment for about 10 to 12 years. I'm already crying. <laughs> you look so handsome. So <laughs> I love you. I love you too. <laughs> Adam has told me how the adults in his life are also his role models especially in the relationships they have with each other. You both have grandparents who have been married over 50, even over 60 years. Alyssa, your parents have been married for over 25. What shining examples of how to create and sustain a life together. When Alyssa and Adam started dating over 10 years ago, it didn't take me long to see what she saw in him, especially since Adam never complained about me constantly tagging along, <laughs> even during cuddle sessions. <laughs> One of my favorite memories is when I was in the car with them as teenagers. Adam got out to not only pump gas for Alyssa, but came back with two Arizonas, two candy bars, and a box of donuts for the two of us. Alyssa, I hope you're grinning the way that I am as I write this. With more than 3,800 days of memories, in different chapters of our lives, a new beginning starts today. I promise that though I cannot control the wind, I will be your ship to carry you to safety. I promise you that you will never be lonely, for I will always be your companion. I love you forever and always, Mrs. Washburn, your soulmate, Adam Washburn. Adam Lee, I'll never know how, but at 14 years old, I just knew it was you. And it was, and it still is and it always will be you. I love you for the boy that you were, the man that you've become, and all the other versions of you that I cannot wait to see. I vow to always say I love you at least once a day. I vow to love you endlessly and unconditionally until my last breath and after that, in this life and in the next, just like when we were kids. I love you, nerd. <laughs> Adam and Alyssa, having proclaimed your love for and commitment to one another in the sight of Almighty God and these witnesses, it is my pleasure to pronounce you by the power of in you by the Universal Life Church and the state of Florida, husband and wife. Adam, you may now kiss the bride.
gathered guests, it is my great pleasure to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Adam and Alyssa Washburn. Adam and Alyssa, they made it through middle school, high school, college in different states, and they've already been through so many life stages together. Adam's dad passed away, he was only 14, and it's hard for me to talk about, it was hard for me to even write this down today. I speak for a lot of our family and friends here today, including your dad, when I say, I'm so proud of the man you've worked so hard to become. We are all so happy to see the two of you married today. And I couldn't imagine a better pair of humans to commit to sharing their entire future together. Everyone raise your glass. Here's to you, Adam and Alyssa. I love you guys.